Hey you guys, I'm back with another wintry tutorial. This one is a 3D knit nail using 3D gel. I really, really love this look. It's super cozy for winter and I hope you guys enjoy it. Let's jump into the tutorial. Using 3D gel, roll a long snake of gel. Make it double the length that you'd like the final length to be. I'm using a little bit of water on my finger and on the form paper to keep the product from sticking. Next, pick up the gel and drape it over something like a needle or a fine dotting tool. Um, make sure you fold it in half evenly and then begin to twist the gel around itself, starting at the top and working your way down to the end. Try to keep even pressure and don't wind too tightly. Repeat the same steps as before, but this time twist the gel in the opposite direction. If you twist it in the same direction as the first strand we made, it won't look like a braid when they are side by side. Carefully pick up one strand and place it on the nail, then trim the excess gel on the side walls. I kind of just gently push the gel along the sidewalls too while I'm doing this just to make sure that it's secured to the nail. Um, and by the way, I pre-polished this uh, tip with, I believe it's 139 uh, gel polish from Ugly Duckling and I've left the inhibition layer on there. Um, this is to help adhere the uh, strands of 3D gel also. So I've just applied the second strand and you're going to see here I'm using my finger with a little bit of wa um, <laughs> wet water <laughs> and I'm just lightly pressing that strand uh, against the other one and kind of pushing it down slightly too. Again this is making sure it's adhered nicely and also um, pushing them closer so they look like an actual braid or line of knitting. <laughs> Now there are a lot of different combinations you could do uh, with this technique. For this nail, I just did the main row of knitting in the center and now I rolled out a really, really skinny snake of gel and I'm repeating the same steps as before. Um, this is going to act like a border on either side of the um, main line of knitting here. So you'll see once it's side by side, it's not super, super small, but it's definitely noticeably smaller than the main row. So I'm going to go ahead and just repeat the same steps on either side using smaller snakes of the 3D gel. Just making sure it's nice and adhered properly, trimming off the excess. And then I'm going to add another row on the other side and pop it in the lamp for a cure. Once I've cured the 3D gel, I'm going back with my no wipe top coat or mat, depending on the look that you want. You're going to apply it on either side of the um, knitting that you did. Don't apply it over top because you'll lose definition and it looks better if it's matte. And then you're going to pop that in the lamp for a cure. And voila! Your knit nail is complete. This is a super, super cute technique I've seen some Russian artists doing and I wanted to show you guys how to do it. I hope you enjoyed this video and we'll see you in the next one. Bye! Hey, let's be social. Find me on Instagram at Natasha Harton.